Chicoria Herbie Hancock. It was like, oh, I have to do this, man. Yeah. And uh, I went, and it was mind blowing. It was Gambali, Weko, and and Patatucci. That looked, let's just say, my tickets weren't that good, but from a distance, it looked like a. I don't like. I don't know, man. It was like a like a plane. Yeah. <laughs> he was flying, man. Yeah. It was. Yeah, yeah. His Yamaha, I think. Yeah, it was the, his Yamaha. Yeah. Uh, or maybe the Ken Smith back then. It was. It was after the Ken Smith. It was, oh, it was it the was Yamaha. The Yamaha. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you're right. That's right. Yeah. Shortly after he went out. Yeah. It was the Ken Smith and what he was playing was just mind blowing, uh, you know, inspirational, and it kind of cracked the door open. It was the seed was planted, and by then. I was starting to play again with a four string. Yeah. Only had a four string, yeah. and uh, started doing gigs and local gigs here in LA. But then I remember exactly. I was I did a gig with Kenny Lee Lewis, who's now working with uh, Steve Miller. He's been there. Okay, yeah, yeah. And we would do a lot of local gigs, and, and we went to have dinner somewhere or a, a, a bite after the gig. And I heard this beautiful melody, man. And you could tell right away that it was fretless, and the, the melody, the the frequency, it was like. It was like the guitar playing on the E and the A string be beyond the 12th fret. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it would stay there. It was like that frequency, that very cool. That vocal like cool. almost. And I oh, go yeah. and find out what it was. It was Elaine Caron. Oh. Yousef. Yeah. Whoa, Yousef, man. Like, that blew my mind when I used to have tapes, you know, back in the day. I had tapes, all the Yousef tapes. I used to yes. The car all the time. I actually had a long... Long drive with Elaine Karen once yes. down to Manchester Airport, but that's another story. Yeah, but, yeah. Yeah, fantastic player, yeah. When I put my trio boom, together, boom, I boom, realized, boom, boom. yeah, yeah, I realized what it was uh, when I saw Patatucci, which just wouldn't move from certain positions, and he recovered so much ground, and I think you. Crazy. Uh, Renato Neto, he's playing with the trio. Oh, wicked, wicked. From Prince. Anyway, uh, so I noticed that they could cover a lot of ground, let's just say that, yeah. without moving. Without so moving. I kind of, that's one of the reasons why I decided to go there, because I would sing a lot. I was singing a lot then. And you could... And the four, yeah. I, I, you know, it was really hard to, to go from octave to octave and do fingers up here, and, and it really messed with my singing. This so you got a lot of to, range in one area. Yeah, and, and you'll notice uh, it becomes very apparent when I play with the trio, so you cover a lot of ground. But uh, So... Uh, yeah, man, the six string came about, and uh, I and don't then, spend enough yeah. time with it. I I got to tell you, I pulled it out two hours ago to do sound check, and it's like, oh, I love it. It's home. Passion. It's home. Yeah, yeah. This is home. You know, for some reason, I I found my niche. Yeah, and, and it has nothing to do with the amount of strings or all that. It's just I feel at home. It's simple. It's instinctual. I don't think about it yeah. too much. The thirty-four scale. Yeah, ESP, this is, let's talk about this actually. ESP so. built this one. It's just amazing. Okay, They're okay. building some beautiful stuff. And, uh, and it's a super thin body, isn't it? Super yeah. thin. I, I like I like to be able to feel the base against my body. Yeah, yeah. So the, the contour is kind of like yeah. under my left under your rib cage, breast, rib yeah, cage yeah. right here. Because you can feel. You can feel the I actual feel resonance the against yeah. yourself. Yeah. So. Yeah, they're doing a beautiful job, man. EMGs, active, you know, nine volt. And uh, this, we're talking about possibly making it available. I have a, a four string coming out. Oh, really? Yeah, so you're doing a four as well. Uh, pretty soon, before NAMM show. This is what, October? It is October. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. yeah. This I'm going to be, be at NAMM This will be well. like um, available, built to order for cats that want to play around with it. I have a few friends that want it, a few. And you've got any tips for, you know, for fretless players? 